Hi, Alexandra Gaid, and what is happening to Brexit? Here we go. So, we've got some things going. So, at the moment, Northern Ireland and Ireland has a problem about a deal, you know, a trade deal between uh, the European Union and Britain. So, it's a bit chaotic over that side. Um... There is also talks that they want to delay Brexit for one to two years, which I think can't they sort it out. They've had all this time. And there, you know, it's a total shambles, you know. It's uh, chaotic, you know. Um, no one seems to know what they know about what they're doing. Hi, Alice. So, what is Brexit to us? Well, depending if the if it, if it's a no deal, it means food prices will rise. Also, if we go to Europe, you could require a visa, but there is talks a visa free, but we don't know what will happen that. And also, this this saying: if you take your mobile phones, uh, you will take the EU roaming off or something. But we are uncertain of that. But it's a bit mixed story at the moment. Uh, and and also, we are talking about medication, diabetes. Uh, they could have a, a a problem of supplies. But hopefully, it might be sorted. So, what else was Brexit we were talking about? We were talking about um, uh, housing. Yeah, housing was a, a problem. What else? Fishing. We want our fishing rights, you know. And what happens to this, you know... Oh, there's 20 million to the national health, you know. And today, are we going to give £39 million pounds to the European Union? Well, I think it's outrageous if we do, because they, you know, we should not give one penny away, you know. And it's good to see Nigel Farage doing his... Uh, um, his walk from Sunderland to London, you know, in the middle of March. Uh, so let's have your comments on my YouTube page and uh, I'll get back to you. I love to have your comments and I'll reply back to you. So, so let's have your verdict on Brexit. What do you think? The whole thing, you know. I think because it's a total shambles, we don't know what we're doing. But we 17.3 million people voted Brexit to leave. Now, the reason why people voted that day is that can you make an appointment to your doctors? Today, it's still difficult, actually. There's no change. And can your children go to the right school? Well, at the moment, it's probably still the same. But this is why we try and want to change. But there's more European people from Europe has gone back to Europe. But now we get more people outside of Europe come to the UK.